Um, I heard about the Beverly Hills Playhouse after asking a casting director friend about uh, workspaces and uh, classes to go to. Um, and he's a very well respected casting director in, in LA and in the film world. Um, and he was taking classes here, so he said, Why don't you come to see the Beverly Hills Playhouse? Why don't you come study with me? When I describe the Beverly Hills Playhouse to friends, um, I'm really excited and honored to be able to bring the other artists in on uh, the process that uh, I've been in on. Um, first of all, it's a very supportive uh, school. Um, growth, I think, is the main uh, objective for um, all of the students here and all of the teachers here. Um, and there's, I think they have a wonderful uh, breakdown of how to approach uh, filmmaking and a career in Los Angeles in that the main focus is attitude, administration, and of course acting. I was looking for the best. I was looking for a space where I could play um, with other excellent actors and filmmakers and um, uh, theater artists. Uh, I was looking to work under the guidance and the tutorship of somebody that I could respect, whose artistry I could respect, and somebody that just knew the craft really well. Um, and it, it was sort of an exploration in um, finding other characters and other artistic expressions that I could then carry over into work and also uh, an opportunity to, I guess, um, expand on what I've already kind of begun working on. So I, as a working actor, needed a place to be able to go and play and to go and explore uh, my artwork and to be able to develop other characters, um, characters that perhaps I wasn't allowed immediately to develop in, ca in the casting process, but I think by working with Milton and by working with, uh, in a school like the Playhouse, I was able to uh, refine it and perfect it in a way that it would make me immediately castable in different characters, uh, characters other than what I've already been working in. Um, why did I want to work with Milton in specific? I was doing, uh, or I am doing, a series and it's new. Uh, a lot of the experiences working in a series are new to me. The concept of attitude, the concept of the administration of working in a series. Um, and I think that what I needed and what I need is um, mentorship from someone who comes from the kind of legacy that Milton comes from. He comes from the best. All of the classic um, film performances and theater performances run in the same vein as uh, Milton Kinsellis runs in. For instance, we have Marlon Brando to look back on, we have Ilya Kazan, we have Lee Strasberg, all of these fantastic foundations of today's filmmaking and, and acting um, are of the same kind of background as, as Milton's. And he's probably the only, now he is, in my experience, and I haven't been to every teacher in the country's uh, class, but in my limited experience, Milton's class is the only class where I've been able to sit in the class and watch other performances happen and actually learn from even just watching. Um, he's very perceptive. Um, Milton is very attuned to a person's casting potential and also I think like any good mentor sees where you're at and sees where you eventually can be and is willing and is incisive enough to push you in that direction. He's relentless. I've seen him put people on the stage or have people on the stage where he does not let go. Until, um, until they push through into that other layer of performance, which I think is a benefit for a working actor. You caught me on a, on a lap, but anyway. Um, for a working actor, it's important 
to go to those places where we can be challenged, where it's not just about um, getting the next job, but it's about now at this point, excellence in that next job, um, excellence in performance, period. And he's just a brilliant director and just f completely facile with actors, knows how to work us. And I think a person can have complete trust as a performer in his direction. Um, and I mean that sincerely.